Hey everyone, Edgy Berserker back with uh, Injustice 2. It's been a while since I recorded because I actually did a lot of recordings in a row. Um, <laughs> so we left off with Jed's shot. Now we're on to Poison Ivy. And we're still going to do baby easy mode because I have... Whoa. <laughs> I do have a, uh, a uh, stream to get to when recording this anyways i should say i'm recording this on thursday so i <laughs> got i'm down to the wire <laughs> not gonna lie captain cole don't pretend you don't dig me ivy you're right kiss me begin uh, i wouldn't do that if i were you captain cold how do you play her oh, i got a little minion guy okay thank you little plantasaurus rex <laughs> I'm basically a tentacle monster adjacent. That's fine. <laughs> it's funny though, because I like uh, one thought someone gave on like its podcast I was listening to. What DC property would you like to see the Joker style uh, film done to? You know, there's two that I really thought of. One of them was uh, Lex L Luthor. And, like, with Lex, it would be cool to do something with him in which, like, um, just trying to think. Like, you could have, like, you know, him trying to be, like, you know, mayor of Metro and yada yada, right? But you can also, like, do a thing where, like, you know, say he could interact with, like, Clark Kent, obviously, but in the background without having a you could have like Superman mentioned and shit like that. You don't necessarily have to do an origin story with them. You could just have it as like why this guy's hate built up for this uh, sudden being that happened. And definitely don't have Jesse Eisenberg play him. Because Jesse Eisenberg tried to play him like the Joker and he did a very bad impression of Heath Ledger the whole time. Personal opinion. <laughs> and then, um,. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and then the other one, which would be neat, is Poison Ivy, actually. Just like, you know, scientists that just kind of like gets constantly, in the end, with all the toxic chemicals and shit she is like introduced to, she just kind of loses it and loses it. I don't know, that'd be kind of cool, too. Those are like the two that I would like to see that happen. That's why I brought it up because I'm playing Poison Ivy and there's no Lex in this one. So, you know. <laughs> oh, I know some little special things down there. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I could juggle off that. I should try. Okay, here we go. Let's try. Ooh. Oh, we don't even get to see it because he was so low in health. Damn it! <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Poison Ivy is not a character I can really play. She's not, like, she's very slow and set up -y. I like aggression. <laughs> Though I shouldn't say that because, again, I am like a, I want Testament back in Guilty Gear. General Zod wannabe. <laughs> I'm just annoyed that Dark Side's like basically General Zod <laughs> in this. It's like oh, you reuse the assets. <laughs> that is funny though, because I do feel like uh, the next thing is gonna be uh, is gonna be like Injustice versus Mortal Kombat or something. That's personal thing. I think that's going to be the actual NetherRealm Studio thing. I saw that Sindel's just basically evil now. She never had a good side. <laughs> Which a part of me is like, that's kind of dumb. But then I'm like, of course you're going to just say, oh, you know, it's different time timelines. It's fine. <laughs> and yeah, God, that's why like the time travel thing also seems like such a uh, cop out. At the same time, because, like, well, now you could just say, well, we did this. Oh, still canon, though. Still canon. It's just like, ah. 
got me. <laughs> this world's better off without people. Mortals exist to protect the Elder Gods. All humans are the enemy. Begin. Plus, you know what? Poison Ivy's right. It's like they protect the Elder Gods. Well, fuck. Obviously, they don't care about Mother Earth because then this wouldn't be a problem, you dipshit. <laughs> Get that up your butt. <laughs> and again. There we go. Oh my god, this is fun. <laughs> not from you, Poison Ivy. And there's a reason why your name is Poison Ivy. You know, Raiden's just like, first bug women, now this. Jesus. Okay, you can tell I'm just trying to get my stupid thing to happen. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Let's put right the right on hentai is beginning today. It involves a lot of plants. Oh, that was kind of eh, that was a little anticlimactic, actually. Especially for a hentai. What? <laughs> Edgy Bazoiko, why? <laughs> oh man. Begin! Let's fight Dark Side. I mean, not Dark Side. Sorry, Brainiac. It's been a while. <laughs> Whoa, speaking of tentacle monsters, Jesus. Did you have to do the little, like, a little, little, little thing? <laughs> la, 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 la. Oh, my little lizard guy. He's doing his best. What setup was that down there? Was it to grow the little guy? There we go. Okay. <laughs> you do it, little buddy. Oh, there goes him. It's like having the mini me in Voltage Fighter Gaukaiser. At least, like, planty. <laughs> Planthew. That's his name. Planthew. Ow. Oh, I used, I used my meter. How dare I? Oh, fuck me. You know what? At least it was like in the first round, so it didn't matter. Ooh. Oh, yeah, right. I've seen this. It seems so excessive. Why did you have to do that, man? Ah. That was my phone. <laughs> yes, I have Kafka's laugh as my ringtone. Oh, that didn't work at all. Apparently, distance matters, folks. <laughs> My phone gave me a frighten. I'm <laughs> really sorry about that. <laughs> okay, let's see what's up. Of all the men I've charmed, Brainiac was the most useful. With his help, I finally slaughtered the so-called heroes. Then... I whispered in his ear, collect every last city on earth and I'll give you a kiss. And he did, every last city. I finally brought human civilization crashing to the ground. As for Brainiac, he got the kiss he deserved. But he was just a fling, after all, I was going to be busy leading the green. I should have known there'd be some competition. Swamp Thing's sympathy for humans makes him weak. The plants know I'm their real guardian. And when the leaves settle, there will be no doubt. This world is mine. It's nice I've heard him meet um, Brainiac there on the side, of, on the set. Of, uh, you know, the Revenge of the Sith. That really was reminiscent of the Obi-Wan thing. Without the kissing, though. I think it would have made it better with the kissing. Actually, I, I liked Revenge of the Sith, so actually I shouldn't talk. <laughs> Anyways, this is Edgy Berserker signing off on Injustice 2. Next episode, I will see y'all later. Bye now.